This is Uncle Momo's music reaction channel where I provide my views on talented artists from around the world, both established artists and non established artists. And I promise you that you won't be disappointed whatsoever. So why don't you come and join me in discovering amazing, talented artists and bringing it to the forefront of my channel for us to view. Now, this particular song is a song cover and we are going way back into the early 90s to Daniel Bedingfield. Do you remember Daniel Benningfield? <laughs> I do. I remember that song. I'm gonna get through this. I'm gonna get through this. I'm gonna get, gonna get, gonna make it. You know that song? Well, that's Daniel Benningfield. So there is an, uh, a, um, an a cappella group called A&R. And they have, their, their harmonies are absolutely stupendous. It will leave you in a frenzy. I promise you. So this song, like I said, is You're Not The One. Um, if you're not the one, um, what can, else can I say about it? As you know, it's a Daniel Benny, um, Daniel Benny film feel, uh, song. Um, back in 2002, I think that was. I thought it was early 90s, but it's 2002, Daniel Benningfield. And he, he had um, a sister who also, I can't remember what the name of the sister was. Um, let me know about it. But she's now married to a gentleman over in America and living a happy life. But she was doing some amazing songs. And I felt at one point she overtook Daniel Benningfield um, with her career, music career. And Daniel Benningfield took a backseater. Um, but now you don't hear none of them. <laughs> so I don't know what's going on. But look, this is A&R. And I can't wait to press the play button to show you what a and is about if you have not heard of what, who is A&R. So look, we're just going straight into to my next reaction of today, shall we? So, without further ado, you know what we're here for. Great vocabs and a damn good video audio music. Can you dig it? Is there any way that I can stay in your, in your arms? Let me tell you something. If I see any artists more than a group, boy band or girl band, that's like four, you have no excuses for harmonies, especially when you see three amazing artists doing this. Yeah? If I see a boy band with four or more, or girl band four or more, you better be doing some harmonies. No excuses after you've seen this. Please see it back here. Lovely. Mm. If you're not the one, then why does my head fit yours this way? If you're not mine, then why does your return? I've reacted to him before. My He's cool. amazing vocals. If you were not mine, but I had the strength to stay at all. You can listen to singers. I don't know what the future brings. But I know you're here with me now We'll make it through when I hope you are The one I share my life with I don't want to run away you know the song But I can take it I don't understand You know the song now, If yeah. not made for you Then why does my heart tell me that I If 
老板。Certainly set the bar for harmonies. Three of them. No excuses. I will literally switch off any reactions if I don't see any harmonies like this. So you just witnessed A and R doing a song cover of Daniel Benningfield's um, "If You're Not the One." Now everybody knows that song, you know. I'm not even going to sing along to just because it will spoil what you've just heard. <laughs> It's as simple as that. I have been jumping up and down um, when I and ranting and raving to be fair on any artist or group artist or with more than you know four, five, six, seven, eight, nine members in there. And there's loads of those, and they do amazing songs. But what is lacking? What I don't hear from these amazing group is harmonies. I don't hear it. And this is what I'm it's like when I'm hearing these boy bands or girl bands, and they've got the you know six or five. They should be producing harmonies. What you just heard from these three amazing individuals. You don't get it no more. You don't get it. It's the, the songs are so fast paced. You don't know what's going on, and like when you hear the chorus, it's just one note. There's no harmonies. Maybe on a word, but that's it. Where's all the harmonies going? Gone now. Why are you leaving the harmonies to choirs? No. Back in the day, it was all about doing harmonies. Whether you're in a three, four, or five-piece band, and I'm talking about back in the day, as in the sixties, seventies, eighties, it was thriving. On harmonies, it was about doing harmonies. If you're in a, in a uh, boy band or a, or a girl band, so how comes that DNA is sort of like disappeared now? What's going on here? Bring it back, because when you do bring it back and you hear these amazing textures, it gives you such a lovely. It leaves such a lovely vibration in your body that has not been there in a hell of a long time. It just goes to show you that there is certain things that there's voids to be filled, and you don't even know what that void is until you actually witness and feel something that you feel. Wow, I'm missing this. Why has it not been in my life? Now, this particular song 
is gathered, is uploaded from April the 13th, 2022, and is only gathered 253,000. Song like this, now, and I've, and I've said this plenty of times, there is many, many artists that have lesser values than this song that will go into the 13s and 14 million views. So what's going on there? Are we appreciating, what kind of music are we appreciating right about now? Are we appreciating the music or are we really following the brand, the artists? And when you scrutinise their, their music, when you scrutinise their, their, um, you know, their songs or maybe their vocals against a, a rather lesser artist who's got more to strive for and, and more, you know, I don't want to say determination and all that stuff, but that's more drive. And the vocals are sweet as anything and they're struggling. What are we doing here? What is this? What is what makes a brilliant artist nowadays? Is it the vocals? Is it the music? Is it the brand? I remember back in the days, it just being about the vocals. And maybe, yes, how good looking you are, because that also, also plays an important part, apparently. Um, but I, I think that nowadays, and hear me out for a moment, nowadays we are shying away from music. Even though we are, we are surrounded by abundance of music. But what kind of music are we surrounding ourselves by? And what type of music is being diluted from our, from our presence? What kind of singing attributes are we now keen, are, 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 are our eyes keen to? Because our ears and eyes should be keen to this type of music. And the sounds and anything else. But we're moving so far away from this type of stuff. We need to grab on with both hands and to save what real music is about. Seriously. And after listening to that, I'm sure you agree. Until next time, I salute you. Boom. Be that I